certainly a lot hotter this time of year. Mid August certainly could be way hotter than that. Temperatures around 75 and 10. 70 at midnight tonight. Skies remain clear. Here's a live look over Tuscaloosa. A beautiful looking day. Looks like a fall day out there. Look at the blue skies there. Uh, looking at a west direction towards the downtown. There's North End Zone Bryant Diddy Stadium. Uh, currently 91. And while the temperatures in the low 90s, it doesn't feel all that hot today. And that is due to light north northwest wind and also that drier air moving in from the north northwest. Probably noticed that today and yesterday, the lack of humidity. It feels a pretty nice this afternoon, especially in the shade. 91 to Tuscaloosa. Look at that 80s up and down I-65 from Coleman to Warrior to Birmingham down towards the Clanton area. Clanton officially at 90, but close to those upper 80s there. Again, not feeling bad thanks to that lack of moisture. Look at the dew points. Dew points below 70 this time of the year is very welcome. We got dew points in the 50s and that is extremely rare for this time of year. 55 is a dew point in Tuscaloosa and Utah and pretty much all across the area except for a far east Alabama moisture levels a little bit higher over there near Anniston and Roanoke but overall the moisture is low and that means no rain today across our neck of the woods and where that moisture is a little bit higher to the east and southeast Anniston I would do note there are a few scattered storms in that part of the state that's close to the Georgia border that stays put today uh, tomorrow though I think around here we're going to start seeing more of that activity closer to our neck of the woods as moisture levels do come up just a bit on Friday even on Saturday and on Sunday. So the less humid air for now will be changing by the time we go into Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Moisture levels coming up. It's not going to be overly hot, though, and that's one good thing. The big upper air ridge over the western U.S., and that stays put. And notice a little bit of green there showing up, representing the chance for a shower storm on Friday. A better rain chance will arrive by early next week as we go into Monday, Tuesday, and on Wednesday. Forecast tonight lows back in the upper 60s. Really nice out there tonight. We've got plants outdoors, maybe a late evening walk. Uh, tomorrow we'll top out in the lower 90s. Plenty of sunshine, isolated shower storm late in the day. That'll be after 1 p.m. tomorrow. Chance of rain only about 10%, then 20% for the weekend Saturday. And on Sunday, we'll top out those lower 90s, overnight lows in the lower 70s. There's a better.